good head. You just found her. A woman. Tom Torero, Street Hustle, with some mighty erections behind me. That's right, in true Roger Moore, James Bond, cheesy 90s style. It's all about sexual innuendos being British today. Today's tip is called carrying a phallic object. It could be a water bottle, it could be a baguette, it could be a banana, whatever you want to hold in your hand, gentlemen, to calm you down on the street. Don't carry coffee, because that means you can't eye date, you can't instant date, you can't just say, I'm nipping over for a quick coffee when you're carrying a coffee. So I like to carry a bottle of water. Something in your hands, nice and firm, big and long, calms you down. It's good for you as well, drinking water. But the main purpose of the phallic object is to waggle it at her, to wiggle it at her, to prod her with your hard object, yeah? It's part of the accusing frame in the stacking section of the London Day Game model. So you open and then you stack forwards with teasing and challenging and storytelling and role play, like you're the teacher, like you're the dad. You can waggle it at her. I like to prod her with it or point something out. I once saw my friend Sam Django in Oslo a couple of years ago in Norway, carrying his lunchtime baguette. Not only stuffing it into his mouth to calm him down, but uh, prodding her with this baguette or hitting her in a playful fashion and she absolutely loved it. So, if you're British, certainly get hold of a phallic object. If you're from foreign shores, you're across the pond in America, watch some Roger Moore, watch some James Bond to know what I'm talking about. Gives you a cheeky glint, gives you a bit of a smirk, and that's the ultimate frame, the accusing frame for the street hustle.